Hey everyone, it's Blue Lizard Jello, and welcome back to Blue Plays Elden Ring here in the Wood Folk Ruins. It's huge, it's massive. This is the entirety of the ruins, all the way in this section. Possibly even that. <laughs> Who knows? I didn't realize we were so close to the uh, mine there. That's pretty exciting, because that's where we're going to be heading today. But first, here are my stats, level 91. Pause it if you want to know any more. And we, yeah, we're just going to, without delay, head over to the mines and see about getting some more upgrade materials. That is what I want to do. So, that was, what, south? I should probably actually take a look just kind of southwest of us. Perfect. Should be right up here against this wall somewhere. And sure enough, there it is. Sight of Grace right on the inside, I imagine. And what level are we going to get? What level stones will we be getting here? First off, lantern time for sure. I just turned it off. <laughs> And as always, instead of taking, well, actually, we'll send the elevator down, and then we're going to just take this path, see if there's anything along the way. Nothing so far. Ooh, jump. I don't ever trust that roll anymore. And no, just an alternate way down, which is, which is fine. Okay. So what is about the Altus Tunnel? All right, some of the tunnels have actually been pretty difficult. I don't know if they're supposedly named after their, their challenge level, but anything labeled tunnel, like Gale Tunnel, like Celia Tunnel, they're, uh, they're pretty difficult. Okay. Just some miners. Oh, why would you target that one? I mean, really, why would you target that one? Whoa, you're fast. Whoa, 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 whoa. Jiminy crickets. <laughs> I should probably just restart that. Oh, a chest right away? And what level, what level? Five. Excellent. I'm all about the fives right now. Rune arc. I dig it. What do I... Is that a... Oh, it's one of the uh, the cool little dragon snail things. I actually like them. Can I get a backstab on you? That'd be cool. Can I get a backstab now while you're standing up? Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Nope, nope, nope. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. Oh, I would actually really be excited to get another rock digger sorcery. I'd like to play around those more. Yeah, I know you're alive. I know your games. Enjoy. Crystal darts, lots of cracked crystals. Okay, so level five, this is good, this is perfect. I should be able to level up some more stuff here. Okay. The only one that I'm, well, the only ones I'm truly concerned about are those guys, so I'm actually going to toss a cannon up there. Quickly. Oh, I'm not going to get the splash on the other one, I don't think. I got it. Excellent. One shot. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Who's, who's doing what now? What did you just cast? All right. Look, it sounded like a cuckoo glintstone. Do I need a rush? Do I need a rush, whatever you are? Ow. Uh-oh. There we go. Oh, carrying greatsword. Starting to come into your own there. And I'm seeing loads of upgrade. Oh, that's a somber level five at that. Uh-oh, do you see me? Somehow you don't. Land, fall down. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, dealt with. Arterial leap times two. Oh, man. These guys are actually hitting pretty hard. That's. That's maybe okay. That might be okay. Tell you what. What kind of damage am I doing with a backstab? Why am I not doing a backstab? 
There it is. Oh, yeah, it's not really enough. But with the glint blade. There we go. Okay. Smithing stone level five. You know, actually, these ones are placid if you don't take their stuff. We learned that in Celia Tunnels. So maybe. Maybe I just leave them alone. Okay, hold on. Let's stay, let's stay organized here. So up there there's nothing else. We came from that direction. We can grab all that. I don't even think I need any more. I have so many cracked crystals. So instead of going straight, let's let's take this side path, at least take a look, see where it leads. I almost went back and grabbed those instinctively, and then I would have been in trouble. Uh, why? why? Why do I have one of these things? I don't want that. Okay, well. Can we poison it? Can we poison it? I think that's going to be the question. Also, got a sword again. Sort by item type. Horn bow. Oh, no, no, no. What? Blue, 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 blue. You silly goose. Come on, serpent. Got him once. Okay. Oh, it's, this is an enchanted shot. Actually, this is probably the perfect weapon art for this guy. Let's get a second. Is poison? Not yet. Okay. Two more. Let's see if we can get the poison. I mean, he's some sort of insect, so maybe not. Oh, there we go. He's poisoned. Oh, beautiful. Okay. Well, let's just kind of finish him off then with some lightning bone. Uh-oh. What kind of damage? Not, not great. Yeah, lightning bone doesn't seem to be doing much at all. It could be because it's not fletched. I think that's actually it. So real quick, let's do, let's get rid of the rat again. And let's put on the effective reach talisman. Uh-oh. Oh, I didn't have any uh, FP. Let's top that off. Let's see what kind of damage we do. Much better, much better. Okay, a couple of arrows. There we go. You know, actually, I might still be getting some drop off though. What is fletched? I guess arrows will have a better range. Oh, holy cow! That was a lot. All right. So that works for me. Maybe I don't want to do this just yet, though. How much damage do you take from my sword? Eh, decent. I don't have to go worrying about FP on you. You want me to hop down. Okay, let's not take this. This might be the main route. Let's go and take this path off to the right. And we'll see. Ooh, a lot of, a lot of these guys. Okay, ooh, a lot of them. Jamity. Okay, well, you know what? Let's, let's get the biggest bang for my buck then. Excellent. Yep, that works for me. And then we can just kind of take them out. Some charge our twos. And that might be a boss right here. This might be... Oh, Crystallians. One. Two. Is it two? <laughs> Is it two? I've already fought two. Part of me thinks that there's going to be another one. All right. Well, you know the drill. We got our shield boys, so we're probably going to be fine. <laughs> and then we're definitely going to be using Rock Sling. All right. Let's get in there. With 38,000 runes. Why not? All right. Here we go. Ah, sp Spear and Ring Blade. That's fine. That should be fine. 
Not good. Waste all those. All right, yep, let's just, uh, actually, since they're gonna be grouping together like this so nicely, how about just a little big old charges? Not a lot of damage, but it knocks them down. Okay. A little bubble action. There we go. Knocked him. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh. Nope. Run, 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 run. Okay. Focus on the one. Focus on the one. Nope. Here we go. A little full moon just because it's silly. Oh, wait a minute. Did you get your armor back? Oh. Just about toast. There we go. One left. And my shieldy boys doing their thing. And it's time for rock sling. Let's just do some good old fashioned rock sling. Yeah, it's done. It's over. It's over. <laughs> oh, too good. Too good. I love it. I love my shieldy boys. Somber stone, mine is bell bearing too, so that's gonna be for my somber smithing stones. Okay, yeah. So is that gonna be three and four then, I imagine? Three, four, and cracked crystal, oh good, because I don't have enough of those. So I can buy one, two, three, and four sombers. I would love though, however, to get regular smithing stones as well. That would just be the absolute bee's knees, as they say. Uh, 47,000, I should go level. I only need 2,500. No, because what if that big guy comes back? Oh my gosh, I'm being so foolish right now. So reckless. I mean, I don't have any, I don't have anything left. Oh, this is dumb, right? Especially because I'm doing a jumping puzzle. Oh, careful now. Oh, wait a minute. Is there just nothing here? No, there is a path through that broken wall. Oh, oh, boy. Right? There's going to be a path right here? No? What? Oh, I travel up. Ah, okay. Arsenal charm plus one. It's a plus one, which you know doesn't make me excited, but it is a plus one. Uh, excuse me, it is an arsenal, which I don't have the original of. So I don't know what that does or where it even is. Oh, right here, okay. Greatly raises maximum equip load. Oh, talisman was derived from an unusual greatsword once wielded by a hero hungry for vengeance. I feel like I'm supposed to get a reference there, I don't. Uh, so it brings me up from 52.9 to 56.4. That's not, that's not huge. I wouldn't say that that's greatly. Also, I should probably change that back to either, uh, I'm gonna do rate and raise the potency. I think that's gonna be better. So, but wait a tick, how do I get over there? What did I miss? I missed something. There's no way I've seen all of this cave. Maybe I missed a path up. Let's go up here. I don't think I did though. I just kind of petered out. Yeah, less illusory, no. Okay. Doesn't seem like there's a way to get up there. Was there a secret path on the elevator? Can certainly check it. Nothing there. Unless, oh, can I climb? That'd be cool if there was actually something up here. I wouldn't be mad about that. That'd be neat. But there's not. Let's take the elevator and just see if there was a path to roll 
up. What about here? You? No? Okay. Hmm. Um. Well, it looked like there's a path on this side. There is. I don't know if there's actually a path path. But let's... Or unless that's just... No, that's the same thing. Because it just, it just goes around. So it starts high on the left. And loops its way around. So that's... Yeah, that's nothing. Can I go under? No, that's, that's certain death. I don't think they're going to have me come in from another side. It's possible, but I don't think so. I think that there's an answer here. We're going to take another look. If I don't find it, then then we'll move on. But I just... I don't see them as putting that, that really tough enemy up there to block your path, only for you to not have a way forward. But it's, I mean, it's over here somewhere. So it is possible. Maybe there is actually along this wall. Maybe there's a cave that brings you to this side. Hmm. We, we went down, right? Sure looks like there should be something up here. Oh, careful now. I don't think so. All right, never mind. We're not going to, uh, I'm not going to worry too much about it then. I just can't be bothered. Can't be bothered with it. If there's more to it, we'll find it eventually. But what I want to do, because the map fragment was, oh gosh, where was it? Where's the Earth Tree Gazing Hill? That's there. Looks like Millicent has moved on. I can't remember if the map, map fragment is here or up by the Finger Reader Crone. I'm not sure. I'll tell you what, let's start here. Because, again, people told me that there was an NPC that I missed who was standing right next to the map fragment, which, you know, doesn't surprise me. So let's start here. Let's use... Just a little bit. I guess I can kind of look for the plinth. Uh, let's see. What do I have? In terms of hard runes. Level 9. Is that 3,000? 3,800. Okay. So that's enough to level. So I think we're... Did we finish off our faith? Because I wanted to get to 15. Yep. So now it's arcane time. Eh, excuse me. Rather, switch that around. I leveled up my arcane. Now it's time for faith. So from... Here. Oh, we also had that. Oh, man. Okay, next time. Next time we have that cave that was going to be pointed out by that little glowing trident looking thing. I want to get my telescope out. Because I don't remember where the map fragment was. There's a pumpkin head where oh I wish it still showed up on the map once you found it I kind of think it was actually up by the finger reader crone I'll tell you what, let's let's drop a beacon there let's just let's head straight towards her I I want to say it was near that and honestly at this point I can't even remember if I've talked to this particular finger reader so at any rate, we can go talk to her, refresh my memory, and then see if the map was around there somewhere. Oh, and I should be gathering all these golden rawas. Okay, what kind of camp? Enemy camp? Yep, yeah, enemy camp. Oh, some big fellas. Yeah, it looks like I actually need to go up. I don't 
I don't know that I've been up here, which means if I haven't, then I didn't get the map up here, obviously. Actually, no, this sound, <laughs> this is look, yes, right here. Oh yeah, there's an, oh, it's Corwin, or Corin. Ah, look who we have here. How delightful to meet a familiar face, even after departing the round table hold. I've been doing some learning of my own since then, actually, and will happily pass it along to you. So, do you know some new incantations? See, I didn't, I didn't pay too much attention to what he had before. Honebold, I think that's new. Godwin the Golden defeated the ancient dragon Fortisax and befriended his fallen foe in an event that gave rise to the ancient dragon cult in the capital. Oh, so Godwin actually started the ancient dragon cult. Okay. What else seems new? Um... Maybe Great Heel? I don't know. But what do you know about uh, Gold Mask? I'm yet to find the noble Gold Mask. I suppose he'll be closer to the Earth Tree. The path ahead might be perilous, but tread it I shall. Since departing the Round Table Hold, I've come to understand, in my solitude, how little it is I truly know. I'm yet to find, I suppose, hmm. the path ahead. My well, we are uh, getting pretty close to the Earth Tree. May the golden order shine through you. Okay, we still want to head to the finger reader. So I can uh, get my fingers read. What are you guys doing? What are you looking at? So that's the second church. Yeah, you just do your thing. Is that the Mirage Tower? I can't look because now I'm in combat. And I think I did. All right. But like I said, I want to get a refresher. Let's go talk to her real quick. You know, it would be nice to get a bell bearing where I could get the pinion feathers and the four toed foul feet. That would be nice. They probably exist. They probably exist. Yeah, I'm almost certain that I've talked to her. Then again, maybe not, because there's a site of grace right here. You, please, I, you will think. Oh, bless you. <sighs> to the east, ruins of gold. To the west, the serpents. Sacrilege. Uh, wherever the path leads, so shall you follow. Wherever the path leads, only more sorrow. Uh, Tis a curse. A curse. The curse of Queen Marika. <laughs> okay. To the east, ruins of gold. To the west, serpents sacrilege. Well, I mean, I've done this area. I wonder if they mean Volcano Manor? To the east is golden ruins. That's probably where Gold Mask is, I would imagine. Also, I have a sending gate. Oh, there's no way that's going to lead somewhere good. So let's take it. Let's take it. <laughs> and where are we now? Oh, wait. I hear a merchant, don't I? Forest spanning Great Bridge. Yeah, right here. I just ran past him. Oh, dear. Yeah, my... I... Terribly sorry. Uh, are you here as a customer? I am indeed. What do you sell? Oh, some more notes. Excellent. Okay. 4,000. Ooh, Ancient Dragon Apostles Cookbook Level 2. Lightning Pot and Rope Lightning Pot. I'll be taking that. Lots of shields. Red Crest Heater. Scorpion Kite. A warning of surprise attacks and sudden strikes. Huh. Crossed Tree. Old Interleaving Tree, great shields that boost high debt. Yep, we know that. Tree surcoat. And then we have unseen assassins and imp shades. 
Okay, so let's let's sell because we want to. Oh, I don't have very much. I don't think we're gonna have enough to buy everything we want. I'm gonna buy the notes first, and then we'll have to uh, do some farming oh, for that. I'm afraid of very. Oh, you have plenty. All right. So what are these notes? So is what unseen assassins right here. Some assassins cannot be seen with the naked eye. Seems the Erd Tree sentries once carry torches that could cast light on these prowlers. All right, so we've already gotten one torch that had a special ability to keep beasts at bay. Sounds like there's another torch that will kind of reveal hidden enemies. That's kind of cool. Imshade, nothing can touch the shades of imps in the hero's graveyard. Only Roses' light can give them form. Only Roses' is light. So Roses is the usher of death. We see her statues, we have her axe but only her light can give them form. Not sure what that means just yet, but we'll figure it out. All right, a few more minutes. Let's see, let's see where this goes. Got to make sure I return there for that cookbook, though, and that we go back to the Mirage Tower and we activate that one trident-looking thing to find a new cave. My goodness, so many things. Altus Plateau. Oh, good. Dancing people around a, a windmill. And also someone over here... Looking like an NPC, though. Also, where am I? Oh, so just kind of cross the chasm there. You are, in fact, an NPC. Are you new? <laughs> what? <laughs> Who are you? Really? Do I gesture to you? I mean, he's looking up at the Erd Tree. <laughs> Somewhat of a Solea reference, maybe? I don't... I don't really know, but... Are, are you pointing up? Hey! No? You don't like that. No, you don't care about that. I don't want to kill him. So I'm not going to kill him. I mean, that's that's easy as that. It's not like I have to. So what's up with this village? Someone overlooking the village over here, though. Definitely not friendly. Nope. Not friendly at all. Got some dogs. Lots of dogs. Lots of windmills. Oh, this is not some place I just want to stroll into casually, is it? But I have to see why they're just standing around dancing. With some fire slugs nearby? You are enemies. East Windmill Pasture. Oh my gosh, they're actually... Friendly-ish? Oh, they're hideous. Oh, right, 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 right. I, those are not flame slugs. Those are flaming bodies. Okay, now that you're knocked down, excuse me. Ooh, navy hood, nobles traveling garb, nobles gloves, nobles trousers. Oh, jeez. Go ahead, everyone blow up. Twin knight sword. Wait, twin knight sword as in D? And his brother? Just, would you blow up, please? I want to look at this stuff. Okay, so we got a new hood. A hooded cloak of deep navy worn by expatriated royalty increases mind by one point. Such cloaks were gifted to those who departed on missions to faraway lands from which they would never return, but what choice did they have having seen the guidance of grace? This is the spitting image of Roderica's hood. So this is a compatriot of hers, it seems. Hmm. I wonder who that belongs to. I wonder if the uh, chess piece says anything different. Okay, it does. A gift of such rare beauty, a royal wouldn't disgrace their illustrious heritage, even if found dead in a ditch in the middle of nowhere while wearing such splendid raiment. And then we got the twinned sword. Nice sword. There we go. 
an attract oh it's a twin blade an attractive twin blade of fine make that prizes the chivalric way can be wielded with a single hand but its true strength is unlocked with dual handed spinning attacks 16 strength i can use this i can use this and i might actually try it out just because it sounds really 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 fun Oh, look, it is a good looking weapon. So these are R1s. R2s. What about L2s? That's spinning slash. And then it said I can do an additional input, or is it. Really? From underneath? <laughs> okay. I think it's just an additional L2 input. That's pretty neat. Okay, we might be trying this out at some point. So I thought it was twinned as in the twins, but no, it's actually twinned just because it's a twin blade. All right, it's a little heavy for us right now, so we're gonna get rid of that. And actually, I think it's time that we actually call it a part there. Um, I'm not ready for this area, or at least I'm not ready to commit to this area, I should say. What was I using, the Regal? Yeah, the Regal. I think next time what we're gonna do is we're gonna head back to Round Table Hold. Actually, no, we can't, we need more we need more runes. I think I'll do some farming either off camera or quickly on camera. And then we are going to go back and see about upgrading some more staffs and maybe try and finagle how we can use, whoa, is that Volcano Manor? Or is that the Shaded Castle? Shaded Castle would be down below. That's the Shaded Castle down there. So what's towering above it? Maybe Volcano Manor? Possibly. Also, is that a dead earth tree? Ooh, so many things. So many things that I need to do. Anyway, we'll have to discuss at the beginning of the next episode. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.